What's up, legends? Guess what we got? Five cafes you should hit when you get to New York City. Yeah. Today, I have left the pots and pans at home to answer a very popular question. I'm showing you the five cafes you should hit when you get to New York City. First off is an Aussie cafe called Bluestone Lane. Confession, I pretty much have hung out at Bluestone almost four to five times a week for the existence of me being here in New York City. The coffee is on point. For me, it's super important. I do my work out of here, I edit, I film, and so I think we can set up too. And the food, Avo Smash, guys. Something that Australians love, and we can't call it our own, but being an actual Aussie cafe, they've nailed to bring something from the Australian shores to New York. So that was Bluestone, epic coffee, avocado toast to start the day. We're now on to Cha Cha Matcha for all their green tea madness. Cha Cha Matcha, as you probably guessed it, is all about the matcha. And I try to only have one coffee a day, so that means if I want to get a second hit, matcha is such a great alternative. The place is sick. So many awesome people got in and out, always smiling, always happy, located on the corner of Mott and Broome. So here's the deal. You can get your matcha either iced or hot. I always go the coconut iced cha-cha matcha. And then, you know, when I'm feeling a little bit devilish, the vegan banana bread. You guys know I'm not vegan, but I love this thing. It's so wicked. Cha-cha matcha, a perfect way to spice up my day if I'm hopping between cafes. One thing you'll have to agree with me, my friends, is that us Aussies do cafe culture pretty well. I'm down here on the corner of Church and Leonard in Tribeca, where Two Hands, their second location, they're dishing out some seriously epic breakfasts, lunches, and dinners. They're proud friends of mine, Giles and Henry, and I'm so stoked to have it as one of the five places or cafes you should hit when you get to New York City. Mm -hmm. 